some good defensive play there for Harabi to block the uh, first of those challenges. Southall then uh, get it back, try a shot, but a good save from the Harabi keeper. Joe De Godu goes to the number two there. It has a shot, but it's just been tipped past the goal by the goalkeeper. Corner to come. Well, the number nine is through there, Harabi. Tries a quick dink over the keeper. Just couldn't get it down quick enough, though. Good idea to try it, but just wasn't able to get it in on target. Just over. Tries to play the through ball for Jack, who tries a quick shot. Someone gets taken down in the middle there. The ref says no penalty. And I think the reaction of the uh, crowd there kind of says their view on that. They are for sure think that should have been a penalty. It did look to my view that he did kind of get taken down there, but ref still plays advantage regardless of the players arguing that decision. Oh, and Southwell tried a good shot there. Great save from the keeper to keep it out. It was heading into the top corner. And then Southwell had another good chance. And a great block though from the Harvey player. Fantastic defensive there from Harabi to keep that one out. Safa once again with another brilliant tackle to win it back. Chasing down the left hand side. Number eight though, gives it away in a pretty dangerous area and they finally get it in. I think it might have actually been called for an own goal there as the uh, Harabi player tried to then pass it to the keeper and the keeper wasn't expecting it. Number seven though has a great chance here down the right hand side. Has a shot there and it's in! John Smith I do believe. Gets one back for Harabi. Fakes the defenders very nicely, cuts in and then just underneath the goalkeeper. Into the box, keeper just tips it over and manages to uh, take it out for a corner there. Keeper has a stretch for that one. Oh, oh yeah, it actually came off the uh, defender, didn't it? For the attacker, not the defender. Who's going to get this one? Is it going to be Harabi or Southwell City? The keeper's come out and he hasn't got it. And that's going to be an easy goal there for Southwell to tap it in after the keeper makes a mistake. Once again, a miscommunication between the defender and the keeper and has led to them conceding a goal. And the goal scorer wins it back. Number 11 down the left hand side. Can he get a second? He fought down in the box. And the ref gives that as a penalty, but doesn't give the other one that we had in the first half. Okay, that is very, very interesting, ref. Even I am going to argue on that one. And a yellow card as well. Well, the number nine is standing over it, has a shot, and it's into the top left. I mean, to be fair, it was a good penalty, but... Was it a penalty? Probably not. And uh, yes, Southall City now 3-1 up. Oh, the number nine wins it back. Finds the number 11, takes a shot, and then, and the referee finally gives a penalty to Harabi with a handball, I think it was. Number nine is gonna take the penalty. Shoots, oh, and the keeper saved that one. Keeper gets correct, it's still 3-1. Southwell try a quick shot there. Into the goal, it's 
keeper came out and Southall spotted it then just tried a quick think over the keeper I don't know why but I just find it hilarious how when the ball goes near the uh, the third lights it creates like a big shadow across the uh, across the pitch for a split second oh and that's in there I think John Smith got a uh, got a a slight touch in there at the end they bring back it, or they bring it back to 4-2. Very late on. 